Hey guys, this is Xiaomi Mi Band 2 and it's the newest product launched by Xiaomi. It has a small wristband and let's have a look at it. So it has a very simple packaging and this is the new um, Mi Band Core. We can see it has a mirror surface here, it's very beautiful and here is a metal round button, you can tap it and it will show some information. We'll just We can, here is the, here is the core, and this is the band, band and this band has a new design. It, uh, it matches with the new, um, new metal button here, so it has a new design, and in the box, this is the charger, charger cable, and here is the menu. Okay, let's put them aside. It is very easy to just put it on the band. Okay, Mi Band has a OLED screen here and, and this mirror um, surface is scratch proof. Well, you can see here is a little screen. It, you, it can display more things. You can just tap this run button to give you some information. Here is the step and this is the heart rate. And it is very practical because, well, you can just check it to check the time. You don't need to, wa uh, to wear a watch and you don't need to check your phone for the time. Well, it has a um, race, uh, race to wake up the smart band function. Let me just put it on my waist and I'll show you. Okay, you can just raise your race to see the time. And well, many smart bands has the this um, time telling design such as Fitbit, but Mi Band 2 can show you not only the time, it can show you m more things. So I think it's very, very practical. Mi Band 1S has already has a heart rate function and this one uh, has um, has the heart rate monitor here, and you can use it to to detect your real time heart rate. You just need to tap the button to this heart rate icon, and you can see it is monitoring my heart rate. You just need to wait for a few seconds. It can tell you the real time heart rate, and you don't even need to. Uh, with your phone to tell the heart rate. And for this new Mi Band 2, Xiaomi has updated the new step counting algorithm. It can screen out the disturbing movement when you're not moving. And well, it can make the data more accurate. In this Mi Band 2, you can see it has a bigger size because there is a bigger battery built-in. It has a 70 mAh battery built-in. Well, compared to Mi Band 1S, which only has 54 mAh battery, it can give you a, a more standby time. And even though it has a little screen here and it has a Bluetooth 4.0 connection, well, Mi Band 2 still can provide you about 20 days of using time. And well, if you connect it to your smartphone, you, you just need to connect them with the Bluetooth and it can show you the power remaining of the Mi Band 2. You can see it's very convenient. And also, well, if you go to the settings, you can even uh, let the power remaining display on your Mi Band 2. Okay, and you can see here is the power status. And well, this Mi Band 2 is very light, it's about 7 grams. You can just wear it to sleep, and you can, uh, you know, wear it to sleep to monitor your sleep quality. And it has a IP67 level waterproof and dustproof, so you don't need to take it off when you take shower or do some other sports. And it is anti-collision and anti-corrosion, so it's very durable. So actually, Xiaomi always ensures the great quality, so I don't worry about this at all. 
Well, um, this Mi Band One S will vibrate when you have phone calls and other notifications. Well, because when you connect these two, you can see it can tell you other app notifications such as Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, and WhatsApp. So it is very useful. And also it has a, a adult alert for you. And um, well, as always, it can unlock your Android phone when you put them close. So actually, this Mi Band 2 is very practical and I think it is a very good choice. It has a lot of great updates from um, Mi Band 1S. I really recommend this Mi Band 2 to you guys because well, it is very, very useful for me. And if you're looking for some smart wristband, I think this will be definitely be your choice. So guys, check this on GearBest and make sure you subscribe to GearBest YouTube channel. So, um, see you next time. Bye guys.